Hi there, towing enthusiasts. Today we're going to be taking a look at Kurt's four way adapter to seven way and four way with test light. So, as you can see here, our trailer has a seven way connector, but our vehicle used to only have a four way connector. With this adapter, we are able to break it out and have a four way and a seven way so we can fit our plug in. Because without it, it's like trying to fit a round peg in a square hole. When comparing this to other similar adapters, the things that I like about this one over those is that it has both the seven way and the four way. Some are just an adapter at the back that will allow you to plug your four way into it, giving you a seven way. But then you lose the functionality of your four way unless you were to unplug it from your seven way each time. I love having this breakout for your various accessories that you may use. Another feature that really stands out is the tester that's included in it. And I, this is a great thing to have on hand because often whenever you have an issue with your trailer, it always seems to be like when you're out on vacation. And why spend time having to go to a shop to get it fixed when you can have a tester right here and you can immediately tell if the fault is with your vehicle side or your trailer side for a quick, easy diagnosis so you can get that problem fixed and get back on the road. If you have an existing four-way connector on your vehicle, this adapter will attach and it'll plug right into your four-way connection It'll break that out into a four-way that you can still access. So if you have accessories that use a four-way, you're not losing your four-way, but you are gaining a seven-way. By plugging your four-way into the connection at the back of this connector, it'll take all those four-way connections and put it out here on your seven-way, giving you all your necessary lighting, which includes your left turn signal, right turn signal, tail lamps, and brake lamps. We've now plugged in our trailer seven-way connector into the connection at the back of our vehicle and here you can see our lights are operating on our trailer through that seven pole connection. This will keep us safe and legal when using our trailer and it allows everybody behind us to know our intentions when driving down the road because they can see all of our lighting signals. Now if you were intending on using a larger trailer that may have had brakes on it or additional accessories such as a power jack, you may need some additional connections here at your seven way. There are breakout wires for those remaining connections and you can wire those up as well. Of the three remaining connections, one of them will be for your brake signal, which is the output for a brake controller. So you can then add a brake controller. Next, it also has a charge line cable, which is your 12 volt. So you can charge a battery on your trailer or operate a tongue jack. And lastly is your reverse light circuit, which you can tap into the vehicle. So whenever you back up on your vehicle, those reverse lights will also illuminate on your trailer. When not in use, our seven way cap is spring loaded, which will help it shut. And there is a rubber gasket on the inside, which will keep out any moisture ensuring a long lasting connection. There's also a dust cap for our four way. This one is manual, it's not spring loaded, but it does function similarly, keeping out moisture to ensure a long life on that connector as well. Now that we've gone over some of the features of our connector here, let's go over how you would install it on a vehicle that has an existing four-way and give you some tips and pointers on how to get it completely set up for a full seven-way connection. A mounting bracket does come included with your seven-way adapter. Hardware also comes included to get it mounted up. You can attach this to the bottom of your hitch, to the bottom of your bumper, wherever you'd like. We're using a no drill bracket, and this will allow us to secure a bracket to our hitch without having to drill into it, which is nice because you won't chip the paint or anything and you don't have to worry about corrosion occurring at those drilling points. From there, our bracket that came with our adapter bolts directly to this no drill bracket. If you need a no drill bracket and you don't want to drill to get the bracket that comes included with it installed, you can pick up these no drill brackets here at eTrailer.com. And if you're going to be using this just to take your lighting from the existing four pole connector so you can use it with a seven pole, all you have to simply do is plug it into the harness that's coming out of the back. We plugged our factory four pole into the four pole off of our new harness and then take the white wire coming out of our harness and use the included self tapping screw to connect it to your frame or anywhere that's metal and grounded. And if you're just using it for your lights, you're all done. These three wires don't need to be connected. And we'll have all of our lighting signals at our seven way, as well as the four way, located easily and conveniently at the back of the vehicle. The backup light wire, you can simply tap into the backup lights on your vehicle, and then it'll send those signals out your seven way. 
for getting a brake controller set up with your charge line, I would recommend the universal wiring kit for brake controllers. You can pick it up here at eTrailer.com by using part number 5506. This will come with all the wiring, circuit breakers, bud connectors and ring terminals you'll need to hook up a brake controller and the remaining wires from our seven-way connector here to the rest of the vehicle. Once you got it all hooked up, we can test it out to make sure that everything's working using the included tester on the side of our seven pole connector here. You wanna make sure you have your left turn signal, right turn signal, tail lamps, and brake lamps. And that completes our look at Kurt's four-way adapter to a seven-way and four-way with test light.